Hello everyone and welcome to the first episode of Storylines Explained. This video will probably be quite short as I only wanted to use it to explain how the Umbrella Corporation from Resident Evil was founded before I move on to explaining each game from the series. In case you've ever wondered where the Umbrella Corporation came from, this video should give you some understanding of its origins. The Umbrella Corporation was originally founded by three university classmates known as Dr. Oswell E. Spencer, Dr. Edward Ashford and Dr. James Marcus. All three were virologists with some sort of association with the eugenics movement that dominated Europe and North American debate in the early 20th century. In 1966, James Marcus learned of a mythical West African flower known as the Stairway to the Sun that had the power to bestow superhuman powers to those who consumed it via mutagenic viral infection. Certain West African tribes would use the flower as a way to pick their new leaders. When their tribe's boys reached 13, they were believed to have reached adulthood, and as part of their tribe's ritual would consume the flower and would either die or receive superhuman abilities. Those that survived this test would become one of the tribe's leading members. The three doctors journeyed to find this flower in an attempt to replicate and learn from the virus produced within it. They succeeded in finding the flower which did contain viral properties. The virus found within the plant became known as the progenitor virus. The discovery of this virus would eventually birth the viruses that became so well known throughout the Resident Evil franchise, although that would not be for some time. After their discovery, the three classmates attempted to cultivate the flowers in the United States, although they found that the flowers they produced on American soil did not contain the viral properties they originally discovered. Something about the plant's natural environment was responsible for it obtaining these properties. At this point, the group knew they would need to conduct any research on the plant where they had originally found it. And so Oswell Spencer formed Umbrella Pharmaceuticals on behalf of his two other classmates and constructed a base in the location in which they discovered the plant. They then went on to use the newly founded Umbrella Corporation to transport samples of the progenitor virus across the Atlantic back to the United States for further research. At this time, the three found that they would require more funding than they could provide, and so devised a plan to sell weaponized versions of the progenitor virus to the US military. This plan would later become known as the T-Virus Project. This is more or less how the Umbrella Corporation began, and there is more that happens before the first game in the timeline, which is Resident Evil Zero, but next up in this series I'll be explaining what happens in that game, so I feel it would make more sense to save it for that video, so look out for that one in the near future. I'll be trying my best to cover the entire Resident Evil series of games, and I wanted to throw out the short video first to give a brief explanation of how Umbrella got started. Thank you all so much for watching, I'll link around some more of my Resident Evil content if you'd like to check that out. If you'd like to see more from me, be sure to subscribe and turn on notifications to stay updated on future uploads. Have a great day, and until next time, take it easy.